first time we could demonstrate RNAi unequivocally in humans was October 2011. And I remember this occasion very well. And we looked at a curve describing knockdown of TTR transthyretin, a program we still work on today for a disease TTR amyloidosis. And what we saw it the first time was a very clear and unequivocal knockdown of TTR in the peripheral blood of this patient and certainly changed the course of al nidum from that day on. While pharma was leaving the RNAi field, our science and our data was getting better than ever. We had solved delivery, at least to the liver, and we had done so with two different technology platforms, lipid nanoparticles and conjugates, most importantly conjugates. And this wasn't being realized by the pharma industry, and this wasn't being realized by the investment community, but those of us at Alnylam saw this and were quite excited about it because we knew that if we can do this now in humans, we can build an amazing company. Galnac stands for an analog of uh, natural sugar, galactose. And this is a beauty of a very nice receptor system. I usually refer to this as a God-given system. This exists in naturally to take care of transport of proteins which have these sugar molecules into liver hepatocytes for a natural process. With RNAi and the opportunity we have at Al Nilem, I think we really can say we're trying to drug the undruggable and, and in many cases treat the untreatable. And as we strive to do that, we can really attempt to go from symptomatic relief to profoundly disease-modifying therapies. And that's the beauty of this Galnac mechanism, because it works naturally and it works so fast, it works so efficiently. So how do we go beyond that? Because there are other diseases in the other parts of the body. How do we make use of what we have learned from the RNAi to these tissues and how do we deliver them? I think it's hard not to work on something that's as important as RNAi in a company that's as invigorating and exhilarating as Al Nilem and it not impact your life more broadly because we come and do something that we think is very, very important every day. But what we don't forget at Al Nilem is that our mission goes on 24-7, 365 days a year. I still believe we have just scratched the surface now because there are so many, so many undruggable targets all based on the liver diseases. And then in the cases where we can now start creating drugs for patients that could be given once every six months or so, uh, patients can indeed even hopefully in the future begin to forget about their disease. We're committed, we're very passionate about what we do.